Mm. Oh, hey! Welcome to You Deserve a Drink. Who do I think deserves a drink this week? Charlotte Sheen, that batshit crazy motherfucker. So today, we're gonna make a drink in honor of Charlie Sheen. You guys heard that he said he is made of tiger blood and Adonis DNA. <laughs> Couldn't get any tiger blood, but the next best thing is a blood orange. So today I'm gonna show you how to make a tiger blood gimlet. Apaca sips now! We're gonna have blood oranges, limes, which makes it a gimlet, and for a gimlet you either use vodka or gin. So, da ginning! Too many of these and you'll feel like a million bucks per episode. Okay, so let's make this tiger blood gimlet because I'm starting to sober up. So the first thing we need is a Blood orange. If you've never seen one of these, they're super pretty and kind of creepy. They're like the goth orange of the citrus world. Ooh. Okay, so we have a blood orange, and then what makes a gimlet a gimlet is lime juice. So we're also going to juice one lime. Wash your fingers. Duh. Know how to hold your liquor. You don't want to be drinking like the rookie. We got a shaker. We'll put some ice in it. And then you're just gonna juice. Really squeeze that blood orange. I love you, Jen. For Denise, richers or poorer. And then also squeeze in a couple limes. Super duper simple. Mmm, this cocktail's so good. I feel like I've died and gone to all dogs go to heaven too. And then, hello, all you have to do is add the gin to it. Gin tune. Oh, sweet mother's milk. Mm-hmm. There we go. Wall Street! Now what you might not know is gin actually bruises if you shake it really hard, um, and it'll affect the flavor of the gin. So instead of shaking it like a normal martini, you just wanna wiggle it, cause you don't want it to bruise. No, that he's not in that. Just like, you know, if you happen to be strangling an ex-wife, you know, named Front with Nook Cooler, then you don't wanna shake it too hard. Too many of these and you'll be Ferris Bueller's day off your rocker. And then, check it out. A tiger's blood gimlet. It's as simple as that. It's prettier than Denise Richards, but be careful because it actually is pretty potent. So let me give it a sip. Yeah, yeah it hits. So take it easy. It looks like a little sissy girly drink, but trust me, two seconds later and you're all spin city. Or you have too many and then you call your ex-boyfriend and you're all, John Cryer, baby. <laughs> These are really good, you guys. Hot shots. If you're a true Sheen fan, you know that no drink is complete without its sidekick. What, what? A sugared rim. For those who have a sweet tooth like Mr. Sheen. Too many of these and you'll be National Lampoon's Loaded Weapon 3. Now the best part of You Deserve a Drink is the built-in drinking game. So once you've made your Tiger Blood Gimlet, re-watch this and drink every time I've cracked a retarded Charlie Sheen pun. Martini Sheen. It's the game where everyone's winning! <laughs> I'll see you next time on You Deserve a Drink. Grace, cut to blackout. <laughs>